In this video, we have the function y of x satisfies the differential equation dy by dx is equal to log base 10 of x, and the condition that y of 2 is equal to 3. So what that means is that when x is 2, y is 3. Use Euler's step-by-step -step method with a step length of 0.2 to obtain an estimate of the value of y of 2.4. So we want to find y when x is 2.4. Give your answer to three decimal places. Now the first thing is that we have dy by dx is equal to some function of x, not some function of x and y. So we're just looking at the top half here. That's what we're going to be working with. Now notation-wise, we need to understand that what we have here is we've been given x0 and y0. So essentially, uh, x0 is 2 and the y0 is 3. Okay, that's what that's telling us. We want to find y1. So we use our formula here. The next term in the sequence is the previous term, so y0 plus h, which is 0 0.2, times by f of x0. So that's f of 2. So y0 is 3. f of 2. Now, I need to substitute 2 into here. So that is log base 10 of 2. So log base 10 of 2 is 0 0.3. 3010299957 So I'm multiplying that by 0 0.2 and adding 3 and we get 3.060205999 Okay so that is y1 Now I need to get to y2 but in order to get to y2 I'm going to need um, x1. Okay, so I need my next x value. Now, the next x value is the previous x value plus h. So that would be x0 plus the step length, 0 0.2. So x0 was 2, so we should have 2.2. Okay. So, y2 is the previous term, y1, okay, plus the step length, 0 0.2, times by f of x1. Okay. Now, y1 was this, so that is 3.06. 0, 0.2, 0, 0.5999, plus 0 0.2 times by, now I need f of x1. So that would be log base 10 of x1, which was 2.2. So that is 0 0.3424226801. So times that by 0 0.2. Then add on 3.060205999, and we get 3.128690535. Now, that is y2. Now, what is x2 at that point? Okay, so what is the corresponding x value? Well, that is x1 plus the step length. x1 was 2.2 plus the 0 0.2 gets us 2.4. We wanted to find the y value when x was 2.4. If x2 is 2.4, then the corresponding y value that I want is this value here. So we just need to round that to three decimal places. And so that would be 3.129 to three decimal places. That is the answer I am looking for.